Things to do in Seoul, Top Experiences, 2023 South Korea Travel Guide. Exploring Seoul. It is the bustling capital city of South Korea and home to over 10 million people. Despite its crowded streets, it is a modern metropolis with a rich cultural heritage, a thriving arts scene, and some of the best food in Asia. While the city has struggled with issues such as air pollution in the past, recent efforts have been made to improve its environmental conditions. In 2023, Seoul promises to be a vibrant and exciting destination for travelers from all over the world. Gyeongbokgung Palace Gyeongbokgung Palace is not only one of the most iconic landmarks in Seoul, but it is also one of the most historically significant. Originally built in 1395 during the Joseon dynasty, the palace was the main royal palace in the seat of the Joseon government. It was the largest and most grandiose of the five grand palaces, and it served as a center of Korean politics for over 500 years. The palace features a stunning combination of traditional Korean and Chinese architectural styles with its intricate roof lines, colorful decorations, and ornate carvings. Visitors can explore the palace's many halls, including the throne hall, the royal banquet hall, and the royal council chamber. Some of the key features of the palace include the Gyeonghoru Pavilion, which was used for royal banquets, and the Hyangwonjong Pavilion, which overlooks a tranquil pond. The palace also features beautiful gardens where visitors can relax and take in the natural beauty of the surroundings. The gardens were meticulously designed to reflect the harmony between nature and man, and they are especially beautiful in the spring and fall when the cherry blossoms and foliage are in full bloom. One of the highlights of visiting Gyeongbokgung Palace is the changing of the guard ceremony, which takes place every hour from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. The ceremony is a reenactment of the traditional guard changing ceremony that would have taken place during the Joseon dynasty. Visitors can watch as the soldiers march in formation, perform martial arts demonstrations, and play traditional musical instruments. Nam San Tower Nam San Tower, also known as Seoul Tower, is a communication and observation tower that stands at 236 meters tall. Located on Nam San Mountain, the tower offers visitors stunning panoramic views of the city skyline and the surrounding mountains. In fact, the tower is one of the best places to get a bird's eye view of Seoul, and many visitors consider it a must-see destination when visiting the city. Visitors can reach the tower by taking a cable car to the top or by climbing the mountain on foot. The cable car ride is especially popular as it offers breathtaking views of the city as it ascends the mountain. Once at the top, visitors can enjoy the observation deck, which offers unobstructed views of Seoul and beyond. On clear days, it is even possible to see as far as the Yellow Sea. The observation deck is not the only attraction at Nam San Tower, however. The tower is also home to several restaurants, cafes, and gift shops, as well as the Teddy Bear Museum, which features a collection of teddy bears from around the world. The tower also features a digital observatory where visitors can learn about the history and culture of Seoul through interactive exhibits and displays. Nam San Tower is especially romantic at night when the city lights up in a spectacular display. The tower itself is also illuminated with colorful lights, making it a popular destination for couples and tourists looking for a romantic night out. Dongdae Moon Market Dongdae Moon Market is one of the most popular shopping destinations in Seoul, and it's easy to see why. The market is a bustling hub of activity that never seems to sleep, with vendors selling everything from clothing and accessories to electronics and souvenirs. Visitors can find great bargains on a wide range of products, making it a must-visit destination for budget-conscious travelers. The market is divided into different sections, each with its own specialties. For example, the Dongdae Moon Shopping Complex is a popular destination for fashion lovers, with over 26 shopping malls and department stores selling everything from designer clothing to trendy streetwear. The Pyeonghwa Fashion Town, on the other hand, is a great place to find affordable clothing and accessories with vendors selling items at wholesale prices. One of the highlights of visiting Dongdae Moon Market is the night market, which opens at midnight and runs until dawn. The night market is a popular destination for locals and tourists alike, with vendors selling street food, clothing, and other items throughout the night. Visitors can enjoy traditional Korean snacks like topoki, hotok, and mandu while shopping for bargains at the same time. In addition to shopping and eating, Dongdae Moon Market is also a great place to soak up the atmosphere of Seoul. The market is always crowded and bustling, with vendors shouting out their wares and customers bargaining for the best prices. Visitors can also see some of the city's most iconic landmarks from the market, including Dongdae Moon Gate, which is one of the four gates that used to lead into the city. 
Bukchon Hanok Village. Bukchon Hanok Village is a charming neighborhood located in the heart of Seoul that offers visitors a glimpse into traditional Korean life. The village is home to hundreds of Hanok, which are traditional Korean houses that have been preserved for centuries. These houses feature beautiful wooden architecture, clay tile roofs, and intricate details that reflect the unique culture and history of Korea. Visitors can explore the narrow alleys and peaceful courtyards of the village, which are filled with traditional Korean homes, small shops, and cafes. The village is especially popular for its traditional Korean culture experiences, where visitors can learn about traditional crafts like pottery, calligraphy, and Korean papermaking. Visitors can also experience traditional Korean tea ceremonies, where they can sample different types of tea and learn about Korean tea culture. One of the highlights of visiting Bukchong Hanok village is the opportunity to interact with the local residents. Many of the Hanok have been converted into guest houses or cultural centers, and visitors can stay in these traditional homes and experience traditional Korean hospitality firsthand. Visitors can also learn about the history and culture of the village through guided tours, which are offered in English and Korean. Namde Moon Market Namde Moon Market is one of the most famous and oldest markets in Seoul, dating back to the Joseon Dynasty. The market is known for its vibrant and bustling atmosphere, where visitors can find a wide range of products, including clothing, accessories, traditional Korean handicrafts, and souvenirs. It's also a great place to sample some of the best street food in Seoul, with vendors selling a variety of savory and sweet treats. One of the must-try foods at Namde Moon Market is topoki, which are spicy rice cakes that are a popular snack in Korea. The dish is made by stir-frying rice cakes with spicy sauce, fish cakes, and vegetables, and it's often served with boiled eggs and cheese. Another popular food to try at the market is hotdog, which are sweet Korean pancakes filled with brown sugar, cinnamon, and chopped nuts. They are a popular winter snack and are best eaten hot off the griddle. In addition to food, Namde Moon Market is also a great place to find traditional Korean handicrafts such as pottery, silk, and traditional clothing. Coex Mall Coex Mall is one of the largest underground shopping malls in Asia with over 200 stores, a movie theater, an aquarium, and even a casino. The mall is also home to many events and exhibitions throughout the year, so make sure to check the schedule before you go. Coex Mall is a massive underground shopping mall located in the Gangnam district of Seoul. With over 200 stores, the mall is one of the largest underground malls in Asia and a shopper's paradise. The mall features a wide range of stores, from high-end luxury brands to affordable fast fashion retailers. Visitors can find everything from clothing and accessories to electronics and cosmetics. In addition to shopping, Coex Mall offers a variety of entertainment options for visitors. The mall is home to a Megabox Coex, which is a popular movie theater that screens both Korean and international films. The Aquarium, which is one of the largest in Korea, offers visitors the chance to see a wide variety of marine life up close, including sharks, stingrays, and sea turtles. For those looking for a bit of excitement, Coex Mall also has a casino, where visitors can try their luck at a variety of games. The casino is open 24 hours a day and offers a range of games, from slot machines to table games like blackjack and baccarat. Myeongdong Myeongdong is a bustling and trendy shopping district located in the heart of Seoul. It is a must-visit destination for anyone interested in shopping, entertainment, and street food. The district is especially popular with young people who come to explore the many shops and experience the vibrant street food scene. Myeongdong is home to many international brands as well as local boutiques and designer stores. Visitors can find everything from trendy streetwear and accessories to luxury fashion and beauty products. The district is also famous for its beauty stores, which offer a wide range of Korean beauty products and skincare items. In addition to shopping, Myeongdong is also a great place to experience the vibrant street food scene in Seoul. The district is filled with street food vendors offering a wide range of Korean delicacies, including Korean fried chicken, Topoki, kimbap, and more. Visitors can sample different foods from different vendors or even take a food tour to try a variety of dishes. National Museum of Korea The National Museum of Korea is a must visit destination for anyone interested in Korean history and culture. As the largest museum in Korea, it houses an impressive collection of over 220,000 artifacts that reflect the country's rich heritage. The museum's collection includes ancient pottery, Buddhist art, and historical documents that tell the story of Korea's past. 
One of the highlights of visiting the National Museum of Korea is the chance to see some of the country's most important cultural treasures up close. Visitors can see ancient ceramics and bronze artifacts from the Goryeo and Joseon dynasties, as well as traditional clothing and textiles. The museum also has an extensive collection of Buddhist art, including statues, paintings, and ritual objects. In addition to its permanent collection, the National Museum of Korea also hosts special exhibitions throughout the year. These exhibitions feature a wide range of themes and topics from contemporary arts and photography to traditional crafts and historical artifacts. Visitors can check the museum's website to see what exhibitions are currently on display. In conclusion, Seoul is a dynamic and exciting city that offers visitors a wealth of cultural and historical attractions as well as modern amenities and a vibrant nightlife. Whether you're interested in shopping, sightseeing, or sampling the local cuisine, Seoul is a must-visit destination for travelers in 2023.